Dundee. Rangers are current leaders, they've dropped only one point all season. Dundee on a fine run, having taken three points from the last two matches. Here's Ian Ferguson, who scored for Rangers against Dundee United on Tuesday night. Ferguson taking on the Dundee defence. Gary Stevens, the fullback, helping. And here's Ray Wilkins, the England international. Terry Butcher, the Rangers captain, trying to mount an attack. Mark Walters, awkward customer to handle. The cross blocked away. Stuart Munro, the left back. Rangers looking for an early opening in this game. Gary Stevens, the right fullback, with the cross. And that header just wide. Corner kick to Rangers, taken by Mark Walters. Dundee trying to clear the lines, but Kevin Drinkle with the header. Drinkle making his comeback in this game after injury, and Rangers are in the lead. The goal after 11 minutes, Walters with the corner. Dundee failing to get the ball away. Drinkle was alert, and that's 1 0. Gary Stevens, the fullback again, looking to find an opening. Mark Walters once again picking it up. Walters getting past the Dundee defence, the deep cross. And again, the header just over. Walters' corner for Rangers. Richard Goff going up. Almighty oh, scramble here. Goff tries to get in the shot. John Brown shot hitting the post. The Dundee defence somehow surviving, and Ian Ferguson eventually blasting it over. Into the second half, Rangers leading by 1-0. Mark Walters seemingly everywhere, leaving this one though for Ian Ferguson. Just wide again. More footwork by Walters. Dundee getting the ball away, but Walters again challenging for Rangers. Gary Butcher, the captain, winning the ball. But Dundee now going forward. The flick on to Steve Campbell, the wide midfielder. Campbell looking for support, looking to tie this match. Stuart Rafferty for Dundee, picking out Wes Saunders, the big utility player, deep cross by Saunders, Tommy Coyne's header back, and this shot by Rap Shannon, not far off target. Rangers making this vital interception, John Brown sweeping his way forward, Brown looking left, there's Andy Gray, the substitute, Bobby Geddes losing the ball and cleared off the line by Josh McKinley. Almost the second Rangers goal. Here's Mark Walters again wide to the left. Cutting inside Billy Kirkwood, a chip by Walters. 2-0. Walters seeing that Bobby Geddes, the Dundee goalkeeper, was off his line. And how about that for an execution? Dundee trying to claw their way back. Steve Campbell with the free kick. Appeals for handball. And the referee has given the penalty. Handball against Richard Goff. There's a contact. Penalty. Tommy Coyne's kick. No good. Saved by Chris Woods. Rangers 2, Dundee nail the final. Um, I didn't see the actual pen penalty incident. Um, I don't know if it was one or not, but um, it's just one of those that um, you have to pick one way or the other. And lucky enough, um, I picked pick the right way.